And welcome everybody here in Twitch chat and everybody on YouTube for some Bubble Fizz. We're going to be playing another Bubble Bear deck for Meme Tier Monday. Got another donation deck for some Bubble Bear. We're going to be combining Bubble Bear with Targon. And with the Targon region, we are going to be getting some gems. So we're going to be able to use these gems. Um, one mana, burst, heal an ally one and grant it plus one plus zero. That's a permanent plus one plus zero buff. Which is important because Bubble Bear doesn't have any power naturally. And we definitely need Bubble Bear to get some more power. So that's what we're going to be trying with our gems. So we have Gift Giver, Mentor the Stones, and Shards of the Mountain to be able to fill our hand with gems. To be able to give to the Bubble Bear. We're also going to be casting a whole bunch of spells, hopefully. You know, like fill your hand with gems and you play a bunch of these. So that's playing a bunch of spells. Plus our deck has lots of other spells everywhere in it. Even card like Coral Creatures that create spells. So we've got lots of spells everywhere. So we're trying to gonna try to play a whole bunch of spells and then boom, Mind Meld. Um, because you know, imagine we play like 15 spells, then we can play Mind Meld and have all of our um, allies' power and health set to 15, 15. That'd be pretty sweet. But that's what we're gonna be doing with our. So we got Mind Meld. We, you know, so our big brain card. We got uh, Bubble Bear. We got Fizz. Um, yeah, we kind of got a little bit of everything. So the Blessing of Targon is here. We're going to go play our deck over in Normal because it's Meme Tier Monday. And we'll go play five games over there. If we're 4-0, then we'll take it over to Rain. And it's going to be Aurelian Soul Trundle. So this is our first game. Uh, those of y'all watching on YouTube that are maybe a little confused with the, the editing there, we just played against an opponent that just did nothing and quit. And so we're not going to count that as a win, because it was just really not even a game. We played two turns, and then, then they quit. All right, uh, Tarek Fizz, Gift Giver. I mean, I kind of like all these. The Warning Shot protects the Fizz. But I don't know if I don't know if we need to protect Fizz against a deck like this, that they're probably going to be going with, like, Avalanche and stuff like that. So I don't know if, like, protect the Fizz is even a thing. I guess it'd be better to play the Gift Giver first, but I played the Fizz thinking that maybe I'd just go straight to combat, but then I, I decided just to play, play the Gift Giver also before attacking. Boo. Alright, Bubble Bear. You got this. Bubble Bear on Curve. Each life a rare jewel. So we can give Bubble Bear permanent one power, or we can go Pale Cascade. I want to go with the Pale Cascade. Is this the perfect start? Turn three, you play Avalanche, plus play a ramp card. So then turn four, you have five mana, so you get to Catalyst of Aeons. So now turn five, they have seven mana. So they just have, they just have infinite mana, basically. Um, yeah, let's go spray fin. We're at three out. V. RV. Okay, with eight mana, I wish we had more gems, like right now, that we could just use with the Blessing of Targon. Because, uh, of course, I want the Blessing of Targon, the Taric. Um, I guess we're going to. I guess we're just going to go mentor the stones so first. Majestic, but can you Could fly? be bad against another avalanche. Certainly try. But I hope not. Hey, there you go. Gia Leo. Thanks for the sub. 
Love you some Leona Yasuo. Cool. Good to know. So why they stunned the non-elusives? Why would they stun the non-elusives? I guess they want me to block with the elusives. I guess. Alright, so we're going to Blessing of Targon. This. Honor the mountain. And then have it. Cause that's four. Shatter them. Have it support oh, this. Have this support Let's this. Harvey. So we're giving permanent buffs to um, to our elusives. So we're gonna have a three nine elusive and a four four elusive. That's a big bubble bear. And now our Tarek being a six eight with tough can't just die to the eight eight blocking it. All right, so we just got that sub. I got to put that down. Two out of five. Ooh, another bubble bear. So Tarek took two damage. They are enlightened. Obviously, it's a really soul. <laughs> We're trying to make Bubble Bear viable. That's a good hand, being able to play... 7 mana spell, 5 mana spell, and 10 mana spell all in the same turn. That's pretty good. I think I need to hush that thing to keep it from leveling up. doing 20 damage. We need Mind Meld. Hmm. Up top, Sam. You know it. Yeah, zero cost really in soul. Pretty silly. damage. I'm down to 8. I'm going to be hushing Aurelian Soul again. They have gained... Um, 20 life. They've gained 20 life this game. They gained 5 twice and, and the 10. So they've healed their Nexus for 20. And had the perfect ramp. This is maybe, like, the best possible hand they could have. Like, because, you know, just remember, like, those first 4 or 5 turns were just perfect. And then they have all this stuff, too. I think they played Mind Splitter on turn 5, right? Oh, 
Good. Definitely glad we get that blocker in here. Try to block with Sprayfin and Coral Creatures. Try to keep these two alive. Refill our hand with, with gems. Huh. It's going to make life more difficult. Oh, I could have spell shielded one. I forgot about that spell shield in my hand. That was dumb of me. I should have Skull Shielded. That was dumb of me. Should have spell shielded one. A little something from Targon. The constellations bow to me. Can we do twelve damage? Not incredibly likely, but maybe. I mind meld? That's honest. not mind meld. Taric. 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Oh, wait. Maybe we can do it. I didn't actually count it out. Come on, let's go one time. The mightiest Sprayfin. Against all their celestial power. Let's go! Wow, we got there. The Sprayfin. And, you know, had a really soul in for a bunch of turns. And Mind Splitter on like turn five, maybe turn six, one of those two. Crazy. But we still got there. <laughs> those gems are sweet. Alright, I kind of like this hand. Let's keep it. I'm a little worried about Fizz dying. Maybe I shouldn't be that worried about Fizz dying. This is, you know, Noxus Ionia. Maybe I didn't have to be that worried. But I don't know. I kind of wanted to play Fizz and be able to have Pill Cascade back. Now we got another Pill Cascade. To be able to protect Fizz. Um... And we also have a backup Fizz, so now I don't have to be nearly as worried about Fizz dying with a backup Fizz. But that doesn't mean that I'm just going to throw away Fizz for a 3-2. I guess there's no reason not to play this card. We'd still have 3 mana next turn either way. Permanent buffed this Fizz up to a 7-6. I like that. I like that. And keep it some protection for the Fizz.
This Fizz is probably going to kill them next turn. Not sure how they're going to stop this Fizz. Four mana available if I do this. That's two protection spells. Rough technique. Ah, that's a way they could stop the fizz. But good thing they, good thing we played the spray fin. Okay, so we're gonna go gem. That's 10. Bell Cascade, 13. And we still have like three protection spells. This is too good. There we go. 2 0. Yeah, Bipolar, we actually won that Aurelian Soul game. It was crazy. We, uh, my opponent passed with me having a 2-2 spray fin, and that's it. You know, just a 2-2 spray fin, and they were at 12, and we had enough gems. We did the shards of the mountain, filled our hand with gems, and we had enough gems and killed them exactly 12. Like one pale cascade and a bunch of gems. All right, another spray fin, I think. Or, sorry, another one of these. And pale cascade is just so good, but we need more other units. Like, we need our other cards. There we go. Mention the Stones. Perfect. Support Bubble Bear. Good. Another card to support Bubble Bear. We need to support Bubble Bear. I do like that we have the attack token on turn 4. Not on turn 3. Let's go play two of these. Clad in shining sunlight. Better scared. just play Mentor. We got double bubble there. Double bubble. Bear. Double bubble. Permanent buff. Better not be a hush deck. Shape the skies and mold the earth. Ready for the new Call of the Mountain champs? We don't have to wait too long. It's crazy. We just got new cards, but you know we're let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Probably about seven weeks away. Mind meld. Alright, so with 8 mana, let's go gem. 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 Blessing of Targon. Support. Blessing of Targon on Fizz. I think 
two two more Targon champs coming. Not three, two more. There's the next set. Like so, we have two more sets from the or two more expansions from the Call of the Mountain set, and each each of the other expansions, one in October, one in December. Each one's gonna have three champions. One will be Targon, and then two of the other regions that we don't have champions for right now. <laughs> What's up, Vaza? Yeah, lots of wins today. Yeah. So yeah, 37 non-champs and 3 champs, both in October and December. And one should be, from each of those expansions, one should be Targon and two should be other regions that don't have a sixth. So, so at the end, at the end of the December one, every single region will have six. You're boring. You're boring. They're at eight. Mystical levitation requires concentration. Can we kill them? Don't worry. I am here. I'm not worried. Should I be worried? She was born from the mountain. Looking a little long in the tooth there, partner. Go, oh, I didn't really need to attack a Tarek. Probably just should not have played Tarek and just kept my Bastion up, because I guess this is lethal, so I should have just kept my Bastion up. Okay, puts him to two. As foretold. Two's a little pricey for my warning shot. Close to killing me. Save me, Bubble Bear. Save me. Save me, Bubble Bear. Alright, just gotta hope they don't have another removal spell. I don't have any more Bastions. Gotta hope this works. Sprayfin for the win! Again! Against those dragons! Again. Alright, Tarek Vladimir. That's a fun one. We did that one before, Tarek Vladimir. That's fun. Just 
pass. I found my family, my blood kin. Gems are superb. Bad for the teeth, though. Devotion to battle. They are not making it easy to take it. Ow. Don't worry. I am here. I'm not worried. Should I be worried? No, you should not be worried. War Mason. Reporting for duty. Maybe you should be worried. Make the Empire proud. Alright, Pale Cascade here. Kill Cascade there. Hopefully we can get there. Hello, my darling. Who wants to block? You're the least expensive blocker I have at one mana. Why are you here? I ain't okay. Just hanging out. No further. This works out, down to three. Uh, Pale Cascade, good. Right, looks like this is gonna be a job for Bubble Bear. Oh, I guess we have another Fizz. Yeah, I guess it could be a job for Fizz too. All right, job for Fizz. To preserve beauty Not gonna have quite enough damage. Wait, why did it why did it pass my turn? Did the time run out while I was doing the animation? I guess so. Man, I hate how they have that. Why do they have that like that? Alright, well now we're passing turns, might as well just play this thing. Certainly try. So why would the t why should the timer continue through the animation? That doesn't make sense. Like I can't do anything. Doesn't make any sense. Every gem you bestow reflects the beauty of our world. Each is made in your name, protector. Enter, traveler, and stop staring. So, of course, I wanted to just go to attacks with Tarek and uh, Fizz and force them to block with the Vladimir that would have died, but the Vladimir would not have died because they would have had the, that thing that healed it, too. So it looks like we're going to lose the Vladimir's ability. I just have to have, you know, just two more units. Looks like we're going to be losing. 
Probably should not have lost this one. This one's Bastion, not Hush. So maybe they don't have two more units. You know, they're they're drawing and looking for them. Maybe they don't. Maybe it's all spells. This is rather dull. I'm sure. Waste my time. Okay, well that can't kill us. Alright, so maybe we're not dead. That can't kill us. We gotta play Bubble Bear. We're not playing Bubble Bear to not cast Bubble Bear. Not dead yet. In fact, we need it. We need another bu bubble bear. Get on over here, bubble bear. We gotta have some cool bubble bears. Okay. Hope crystallizes. The blessing of Targon on the Bubba Bear. Never submit. Can they do one point of damage to me? That's what they're looking for. It's not gonna do it. GG's, Bubba Bear. And Bubba Bear was gonna do the lethal damage, which was important Victory with my plan. Okay, so yeah, we're in ranked because we're four and O oh now. So we take our meme tier deck from normal to rank if we go four O oh and try to finish out the five O. Oh. Alright, Bubble Bear versus Sejuani. They both have six health. Basically the same card. Shards of the Mountain again is our like late game finisher. I'm not gonna keep it in the opener. It's the late game finisher. The journey is difficult. We're still playing spells, right? Like this unit makes a spell, this unit makes a spell, this unit makes a spell. We still have our spells. There's our shards of the Eyes up here, or I'll cut them out. Hmm. Let's get to it. Let's play this messenger sigil. I've never played that thing before. Let's play it. Why not? I haven't played that thing yet. Alright, getting one gem on this gift giver so that it can block Jagged Butcher. And I guess I could have attacked with it. Fine. I don't want to play the like I'm gonna save the Pale Cascade for after Taric. Lucky you. I'm the last thing you'll see. But I just wanted to have the 2-2 to be able to block the 2-3. My plan's not gonna work anymore, of course. Time to make some coins. Time to get rich. Be brave. I bring clarity. Well, pretty far behind. We're gonna need a lot of things to go right for us. Safety will cost you. Messenger. Down there, guys. 
though. Gotta go with the flow. So basically the spray fin just drew three cards for us, basically. Unyielding. Make it worth my while. Wish that was a permanent buff. three overwhelm damage that's fine ride onward the dead don't need riches fade and be gone why are you here we live here nice! all right trying to take down their elusives some of them. Cool. Got rid of a couple of the elusives. Oh, why can't that target fizz? Because then I'll be able to warning shot it. And get it out of there. I guess that's that's the plan. The problem is that now I don't have very good protection for Fizz moving forward. Sharp. Never submit. Okay. What is this gonna do? The rush, huh? Easy, tiger. I don't even really know what's gonna happen here, but I want to do it. Do this. To preserve beauty and protect all life. Got me. I don't. I don't know exactly what's going to happen here, but we're gonna we're gonna try it out. A deal in coins and carnage. Every gem you bestow reflects the beauty of our world. Each is made in your name. So this attack and do that to the next thing. Look sharp. Heed the bar. Never submit. Yeah, we do that over here. Not my first gun fight. Does this go infinite? Here, Sharky, Sharky. It only triggers once. To protect all. Wanna see a trick? Nah, it's not gonna go infinite. Unyielding. Still, we trying. We trying. Take it up with my friend. It can't be copied again. Could have supported Fizz the next time. What if we support Fizz the next time and it still happens again? These level up champions are ridiculous. That Duani and Gang playing. It's time. They say these were from the protector himself. 
Sometimes I'm small, sometimes I'm big. But you're always Bubba. Always Bubba. Ride onward. I need another hush. I need to stop that hush, not Bastion. Or if we talked to that hush, we could, you know, hush these over these overwhelms, these champions. Hang them by their entrails. Line them up. No one hurts my friends. You spurn my gift. Dang, still negative two? I don't think there's a, yeah, we just can't stay alive then. So we'd have to bastion one of my blockers, but it it should just only save two health. Yeah, then we go down to zero. I'll just let it happen. If only that went infinite with Tarek. If only that went infinite. We need just one more attack. That was still pretty cool. That was still a good game. Pretty close. For the most part. So, um, yeah, you know, I think I'm happy how I played that one. I think that I got that about as close as we could. And so Bubble Fizz, you know, maybe if they just didn't have, they had three elusives there with, you know, the two 1-1 one, one elusives and the, the spray fin. If they only had two elusives, you know, if one of those cards wasn't an elusive, like, uh, you know, another Yordle Grifter or something instead of the spray fin, then we could have, um, you know, blocked and killed their two elusives. And then they would not have had that elusive to block my five power fizz that one you know that turn when they were at 15 when we got the three attacks in with fizz but they had all three elusives um all right so there we go so that's that's bubble fizz um yeah if i would yeah maybe play my meld that last turn instead of bubble bear maybe that would let me have bigger better blockers and stay alive. True. Uh, but yeah, there we go. That was that was a pretty fun deck to play. Gems, gems with Fizz seem awesome. Gems with Bubble Bear, of course, is just Mimi, but still pretty fun. Um, and just gems with Elusives with Spray Fin. Uh, we saw we were winning games with that. So gems are pretty cool. Those of y'all watching later on YouTube, hit that like button over there. And of course, feel free to leave those comments as well. But thank you so much for watching some Bubble Fizz, and I'll see you for the next video.